It's that time once again to discuss five more NFT games that require no investment. We've been at this for a long time, and with newer NFT games coming out, we won't be running out of games to work with anytime soon. Always remember though that these are just the initial forms that these games will have. They could be changed, updated, and even made better somewhat down the road. The other thing is that we are not financial advisors. You think I wouldn't have to tell you that, but I still get emails from you guys asking if I can help with your 401ks. I can barely understand my tax returns. Our goal here is to give people an overview of what these games can do for you and how you can potentially make a profit. With that being said, here is the Game Mag's five more NFT games you can play without any investment. Let's start with something light, relaxing, and fun, which is Every Farm. The name itself tells you that it's one of those farming simulator games. If you played Farmville back in my day, then Every Farm is something that you can play too. It's available for Android and iOS devices, so that's perfect when you're on the go. Every Farm has the basic concepts of a farming simulation game. Like any of those games, you get a plot of land, and you can start growing crops and doing the usual farming stuff. Harvest those crops and sell them for some in-game currency. It's also a social game where people can trade with others for some items that can be used. Every Farm also has some bustling characters that you can interact with and has a slight story that you can follow. There's also the aesthetic part where you can remodel and redecorate your farm when you want to as well. That's all well and good, but let's talk about the part where you can make money. Just for the record, this is a game that may take some time for you to make money. And here's why. In the game, you can earn gold, which is the in-game currency. Now, gold isn't the one that makes you money, but the Fleero token is. In order to get Fleero, you need to get hearts, which is another in-game currency. This is where the long process takes place, because in order for you to get hearts, you need to have access to the restaurant, which you can do when you reach level 35. Getting to level 35 is where it takes time to do so, because you've got to do a lot of farming in order for that to happen. Once you get access to the restaurant, you can use it to cook food and certain items that can be sold for hearts. The hearts can then be converted into Fleero, which allows you to make money. <gasps> But the good thing is that you can also get a good amount of Fleero as rewards when you play the game. Every farm takes time, but if you don't want to spend money and play a relaxing game, why don't you try this one out? And the next game on our list is also relaxing. Number 2, Crypto Ball Z. From one relaxing game to another relaxing game, which is Crypto Ball Z. This ain't no Dragon Ball game, but it is relaxing. It is one of those idle games where you don't necessarily do anything during battle. You're at the mercy of your characters doing the best that they can. It's a bullet shooter where your characters will be shooting from one side until the level is complete. Build up your team and raise some bullet hell and more. You can also enhance your characters, which are the heroes that will make up your team. The stronger your heroes are, the better your team becomes, and the more difficult missions you can complete. There are two currencies that you want to watch out for. The Hero Stone, or the one that looks like a red clump of crystal, is used for in-game purchases for items and draw commanders. These commanders, or at least not all of them, can be converted into NFT. So that's what you want. Hero Stones can be obtained by completing missions, season rewards, and drones. Drone mining allows you to gather resources even if you leave it alone. The other currency is Hirko, which is the token that you want to make money. Obtaining Hirko can be done when you refine Hero Stones. Hirko can be used to be NFT items and even change them for real money through other cryptocurrencies and Wemix, which is what the game utilizes in the first place. Use Hirko to gain money and you need Hero Stones to do that as well. Now that's about enough relaxing for now with our next game, which relies on a lot of strategies. Number 3. Gunship Battle Crypto Conflict This next game requires a bit more critical thinking, but you still have some leeway to relax. We have Gunship Battle Crypto Conflict. My god, that's not a great name. For the sake of this segment, we'll just call it Crypto Conflict. It'll save us time and it just sounds better. Now, you can play Crypto Conflict on Windows, Android, and iOS devices. It's a strategy game where you handle a base and your aircraft carriers. It's the typical real-time strategy game where you send your troops to attack other enemies. Getting successful raids will net you some nice rewards in the process. Use the rewards you get to upgrade your base, strengthen your troops, and invade more enemies for more loot. This isn't a fast-paced action game where you do some clicking. It all involves some tactics and planning your next move. 
tactics can play a part in your victory or cause you to lose, depending on how bad you are. When it comes to making money, this is a bit like every farm where you need to be at a specific level to start farming some resources. You can get the in-game currency Titanium, which you can get through rewards. When you reach level 18, you can farm Titanium at a certain capacity. Use the Titanium to get the token Milico. That's what you want to make money, as you can use it to buy NFT items and trade them for other cryptos. Now, this next game also involves some strategy and also involves tactical action. Number 4. Devikins Devikins takes the number 4 spot and it has some elements that you may be familiar with. But we could use, say, Axie as our example, and instead of having Axie, we have Devikins. The Devikins are the characters for this game and the ones that you have to get in order to get started. Much like Axie, Devikins are made up of different parts. The better the parts, the stronger your Devikin can be. You can get some furry Devikins, but for the best ones, you may need to invest some real money. These Devikins can be bought from the marketplace for good prices. Check the Cleaver Market or the main Devikin Marketplace to find your ideal Devikin. Just make sure to check which ones are the best ones with the best parts. In terms of gameplay, it is your standard turn-based RPG. It involves some level of strategy and a lot of the usual mechanics. The token in the game is the Devi Coin or DVK, which you can farm when playing the game. And thankfully, you don't need to be at a certain level to do that. The DVK can be used for your NFT purchases and other crypto uses. Now, brace yourself for this last game because relaxation is thrown out of the window. Number 5. Alterverse The final game on our list today is Alterverse, and it is a full-blown, high-end looking game. It utilizes the Unreal Engine, so you know you're in for a treat. The concept of the game is that it is a futuristic first-person shooter, and wow, cue the Doom music right now. That is, oh, so good. The game has a lot going for it, although not everything has been implemented yet. You get spaceships, futuristic guns, skins, and so much more. The game is seemingly ambitious, and you can gather a lot of these items the more you play the game. There's already a marketplace for you to check and see what items are for sale. Then again, we're here as free players, so that means if you don't want to pump out some cash for those items, you can grind your way up the slow way, which isn't such a bad thing. It's just, you know, it's slow. Stay updated with the latest news and releases under the Alterverse title in the months to come. Now, hopefully one of these five games caught your interest and you might want to play them later on. For more content like such games, NFT games, and others, click like, subscribe, and wait for more videos right here on the Game Mag.